So this is fresh. Are you religious? If so, what religion do you belong to? Well, I would guess you could categorize me as a Christian, even though I don't believe, but that's what you can put me in. In your opinion, which is the most powerful weapon? Whoa. My hand. How many languages do you speak? The one, two, what two, basically. I would love to learn Spanish. What is your favorite smell? Myself. Logical creature. LeBron James, do you like K-pop? I don't hate them. I don't listen to them personally. How many countries have I visited? I can't tell you how many because it's been so much. I would love to visit Australia. Good question. Jaina asks, if I had to choose between never listening to ASMR again or never listening to music again, what would it be? ASMR because I kind of despise ASMR. I don't like it. I, I think it's kind of boring. Yes, I make ASMR myself. house do you think you've become more independent kidding 
hardly ebb my parents because my parents are now am I don't like ebbing with people. It kind of pisses me off when people ebb me. I feel like it's a little bit as annoying me. But yeah, I've I kind of always have been the independent one, I suppose. My brother not really. But I do like asking my parents for help. Good question. Eric the Savage. Is that thing on says you broke for picture? Good choice, my man. What is your favorite kind of plant based meat? Oh, I don't know, but it's from uh, Beyond Meat, one of my favorite. It's the most expensive one, but it's the best taste wise. Good question. Shocked Gender asks, How are you going to spend Christmas this year at my parents' house? What's your favorite part of Christmas? Do you like it? Um, I kind of don't like Christmas. I hate the whole festive. I, I never liked it. As a kid, I did, but the more you kind of grow up, the more you start to realize how pointless it actually is. It, it, I don't think it adds anything except being around your family. And often, you're gonna have to pretend the people you're with, you're liking them. We all, we all have that one person in the family, you're like, gotta see this douchebag again. Great. We've all been there. Good question. Papadino asks, what's your opinion on Honda Civic Type RS? I think they're very cool. I like the newer models and Hondas. I think you've also got an electric one or like a, I don't know what it's, yeah, a hybrid. I think they're cool, very fast, um, pretty luxury as well. Very nice car. Matthew F. Oz, dream car, and why? Uh, Mercedes GLE AMG. I just love it. It's, it's something about the car, just aggressive front look, nice uplifting life plans. My goals are to get a half a million subscribers on this channel this year, which let's hope we can do it before Christmas would be awesome. Relationship advice. Focus on yourself. That's my advice I can give you. What car do you plan to buy as your first car? Joseph offered us ask. Well, that's a very good question. I've been thinking of a Audi A5, a Mercedes or a Jeep um, but I kind of think I'm not going to buy any of those cars because I feel like I don't know man I do love them a lot don't get it wrong but I kind of feel as if like I would only buy them just to show off you know but then yet again I love Audi it's something about them I just love the confidence I feel safe in it my parents drive an Audi Q5 but my mom does my dad's got his own car and a bike so my brother tries to do his swift Vitara Sport thing is fast the for yourself it, it weighs nothing so it's really fast and he tuned it as well I think good questions very good if you could live in one country for a year what country would that be or school ask oh that's a good question as weird as it kind of sounds I would love to live in America for a while try it out I know I'm kind of negative speaking about you guys but it's, it, it, America does attract me in a formal way, and I don't know why. Jordan 4s or Jordan 1s, Rolex has got Model 1. I don't like Jordan that much. I know I have like 2 3 pairs of Jordans. I think they're kind of overrated. Very uncomfortable. Very expensive. I don't understand why they're so expensive nowadays. Lucas Polensky asks, how do you cope with the stress and anxiety? I'm going to be very honest, when I'm stressed out, I go for a walk. And sometimes I go for a smoke. You know, I've told my dad as well, like, sometimes I do it so, like, I can release the anxiety, like, when I can't sleep or, like, I'm really stressed out. And it relaxes me. But I haven't done it in a while. I've actually haven't smoked a cigar at least in two weeks. There was letters in about, yeah, two months almost. I'm very, very happy about that. I'm trying to keep it like that as well. James Navarro asks, what is the meaning of life? Good question. Why are we on this planet? Very good question. I like that one. I think this is one of the best questions yet so far. What do you think would have happened in your life if YouTube didn't work out? SLM asks. That's kind of a question I ask myself very often. You know, the position that I'm in, I should be very grateful and very proud that I'm in this position, you know. I kind of feel like it came from both sides, me putting a lot of effort into my content, and you guys loving the content back to the 
Also, so much for watching this video, and see you guys to the next Q&A.